maybe Billy Joe Saunders fought. I've come to end of my tether with Frank now. So I've packed in with Frank now. He's come to end with Frank. But if I go here if I go here to earn I can get two or three fights and keep keep the keep the black going. So if Billy can drag out two or three more fights with Eddie Earn and pick up decent money, it's all part of his pension fund, isn't it? He can get out of boxing, then can't he? Uh, whatever, you know, 30 odd and oh. You know what I mean? He might want to get out of boxing 35 and oh. And then job, it's mission accomplished, isn't it, for Billy? Do you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to go cash machine. I need to get some money on it, cash machine. So, as far as I'm concerned, Billy is, the jury's still out on whether he's going to be an all-time great, isn't it? Because if Billy Joe Saunders packed in now, would we consider him an all-time great, would we? I'm not so sure. I am not so sure he's been a world champion now since 2015. We're in 2020. So... Billy Joe Saunders is a world champion at two weight divisions, but will he go down as an all-time great? Well, he's beat Andy Lee, David Lemieux and Eubank. Nigel Ben's a two-time world champion, but he beat seven, he's got seven wins over world champions, Nigel Ben. Seven, not, not two plus Eubank if you count IBO. So as far as I'm concerned, Billy Joe Saunders is not go down, we're not gonna go down as an all-time great. And I don't think Tyson Fury will. He could go down as an all-time great for one night against Vladimir, but it was a stinker, but he got the win. So he, he, he managed to get he, to get all the belts, didn't he, like Buster Douglas did, but Buster Douglas did it in style, but he never did know after that. And sadly, Tyson Fury's only won one world title, so he's got a lot of time to make up. Billy Joe Saunders has got time to make up. Will he ever do it? I'm not so sure. If he don't fight Canelo next, boxing with AD, we remember what you said, don't we? Boxing with AD. Remember everything that you said on your channel about Billy Joe Saunders. If he didn't fight Canelo. It's now you've got your toe in with Sky, you still gotta come out and say them things for credibility. This game's about credibility. Tell me how many lights on here. This game's about credibility, that's what it's about. Now, if you've got no credibility, what you say ya? Eh? What you say ya? Now, like I said earlier in the video, Billy Joe Saunders knows if he fights Canelo, he's got to stop him. He's got to knock him out. Now, if, if Kovalev, whacking him with them punches he were whacking him with, if he can't stop him, well, Bill's not going to, is he? So... So Bill's not going to knock him out, so that means he's got to win. He's got to win every round to beat Canelo. Because the close rounds, well, they're going to give it to Canelo. He's got a showboat in every single round as well. Ten past seven, I could go for a pint here, couldn't I? I'm like that, you know, I might go for a pint. I might go for a pint. Need to go, go get some uh, cash. But... As far as I'm concerned, I'm off at Billy Joe Sona's hype train. And I'm off at Kell Brook hype train. I'm just damn. I thought Dominic Ingle did well for uh, Billy, got him in good shape to fight Lemieux, but since then, what are you doing, mate? You got him in good shape to fight Lemieux, so well done, Dominic Ingle. But as far as I'm concerned, Boxing baffles me. Kelbrook has a win with John Fuchs against a good opponent who had a great win after that. He beat the guy that beat Manny Pacquiao, didn't he? And Kelbrook beat that kid and everybody had a good his performance. Well, he needs to go thank Kelbrook. He needs to thank John, John Fuchs, Kelbrook, because John Fuchs dropped everything and went abroad and he had a young family. So John Fuchs needs a bit of respect, so I'm a bit disappointed with Kelbrook, to be honest. Very disappointed. But it is what it is, and it's boxing, isn't it? It's what's supposed to happen, isn't it? We're supposed to be messed about like this, aren't we? Well, 
was supposed to be messed up like this. Just keep that there. Two seconds, let me just get my uh, get my cash. Finally, finally got some redis. Finally got some poke. That's what it's all about, isn't it? Poke. Uh, right then. Let's, uh, let's mosey on. Let's walk mosey on by. Normally I'd be in there when I'm buying loads of wine and stuff like that, but I'm trying to get me sending a bit of order because you never know when Spencer Fearon is going to come knocking, do we? You know what I mean? We never know, do we? With Spencer, you know we ain't being pound for pound and all that. We've had a game of snooker. We've had a. Uh, well, we had a banana today, I think. Half a banana. Immediately make a U-turn. And uh, I think I'm going to go home. Now turn Let's left. Go home. And then immediately make a U-turn. Oh, I can't be bothered setting this camera on my ugly mush. Off. 
Yeah, so Thursday night. Uh, it's all looking good, isn't it? But like I said, Tyson Fury stitched Duran. Why don't you keep the other guy? Hey, why don't you get some of some British kid guys that some so let them earn some money? Some of the British trainers. If you can't go back to your uncle Peter, uh, why don't you just stick with Ben Davison and keep it in Britain the money? Do you know what I mean? You know, trainers can take ten percent up to I think it's ten thousand quid, can't they? After that, it's negotiable. So. If Tyson's getting 40 million or 30 million, he's not just going to give three or four million to Ben Davis, is he, or Sugar Hill, but if you can't have Peter, who is with Ben, you should have stuck with Ben. I mean, Ben Davidson, he got him in that position, didn't he? He did all that for him. Do you know what I mean? He did all that for him, and look what happened. It's not good, is it? I don't think it's good. I don't think that's, I don't think that's how you treat people. But we don't know what's going on behind the scenes do this, so we can only surmise but all that friends to the end and brothers and all this and we're still mates and all that and we've still got a friendship but not a business friendship we've not got a working relationship but we've still got a friendship I don't listen to any of that it's all rubbish it's all a load of crap it's all a load of crap it's all rubbish I don't listen to all that it's just company men talk do you know what I mean? Ben Davidson's we were running gym on it at Marbella for MTK. I think he deserved a bit of respect. Um, but he's not going to burn his bridges and say what he wants to say, is he? Because he's still going to want to be in with MTK. And I bet he's itching to say something. Because he does give you a lot in interviews, Ben. But I ain't going to feel sorry for him. It's a ruthless sport, isn't it? Boxers have to look after boxers. And boxers are insecure as it is. And people's feelings get hurt. And blah de blah do you know what I mean but this is how I look at it Ben Davison deserved better he stayed with Tyson all that time he even went out to Morecambe put all his life on hold to do all that and then that other guy did all that for him with that Otto Walling fight and that cut and he's just discarded like rubbish I, I don't I don't get that me I don't that's not how you treat people that that is not how you treat people Maybe, I, maybe, I, maybe there's something I don't get, maybe there's something I'm missing here. Maybe I just don't get it. Maybe I just do not get it. And that's why I'll probably always be a small YouTube channel and I'm never going to grow. I don't know. Maybe I don't get it. Do I want press access? No. But Stitch Duran should have still with other guy. What about Kerry Kays? Could have had him, couldn't he? Why not use Kerry Kays? Why not go back to your Uncle Peter and say, let's just move on? People fall out, just like in a marriage. Working relationship, people fall out. Me and Dennis have disagreements. When I always float, blow my lid. You move on. You go put things right and move on. Go back to Mick Hennessy. Move on, but... And then you've got... The situation with Kel Brook and Amir Khan. I don't want to hear about all that now. I don't want to hear about that. I don't want to hear about that at all. I don't want to hear about <laughs> Brook Khan and Billy Joe Saunders. He needs to go fight somebody. I want to hear about Billy Joe so Billy Joe Saunders being a master boxer. That's what I want to hear about. Let's put this over here. Too many people knowing what what I'm up to. Where I go? Put that down there. So. As, as far as I'm, as far as I'm concerned, right. As far as I'm, oops, Daisy. As far as I'm concerned, right. Billy Joe Saunders. Yeah. People keep saying he's a technician. He's a surgeon. I keep hearing the name surgeon and technician. Who oh, is he surgeon? And who is he technician? The mule fight. He just stayed out of the way. The guy was tripping over his own shoes. He kept missing. Let me turn that thing off. Cut out switch thing. He kept tripping over his own shoes. So, as far as I'm concerned, I want to see Billy Joe Saunders in with somebody. Move your car! I want to get in! I want to see Billy Joe Saunders fight somebody. That's what I want to see. That's what I want to see. Oh, I'll just reverse in here. That's all I want to see. I want to see him beat somebody who's got a record. Kelbrook, forget about the car fight. It's done. All right, Kel, it's done. It's 
eight years ago we were, you were talking about that. Kelbrook and Khan, I don't want to hear it. Sky have washed their hands of it, surely to God. Billy Joe Saunders, you've got to fight somebody, Billy. I don't want to keep hearing that you're a technician. I don't want to hear it. And Tyson Fury, stop sacking people or treat people a little bit better than what you're treating them. You've got to stitch your hand on job, but yet that kid with your eye with Otto Walling fight. Perform miracles! Worst cut I've ever seen. So peace out, keep on trucking, keep supporting bo keep supporting bo boxing. Alright. It's a fantastic sport. Shout out to Adrian Hobson, Innovation Alloys and Kevin Hall at SYPS UK Limited. Alright.